the green one and the not green one. Or it could be the other way around. I mustn't prejudge. Oh, you remember her? Thingy, the, uh, the not, the not me one, the, the asking questions one. Names, not my area. Clara! Well, it might be Clara, it might not be. It's a lottery. It is Clara. Well, I'm not running it. Oh, big man, shut it! Oh! You're gonna die this all too! Big woman, sorry. Doctor, listen to me, you... You need to calm down. I'm not flirting, by the way. Oh, God. I think something's gone wrong. Wrong? What's gone wrong? Have you regenerated? I remember you. Your handles. You used to be a little... a little... robot head. And now you... You really let yourself go. glass of coke, it's only this big, but it's actually got this much sugar in it. Works a bit like that. What does? The TARDIS. It's bigger on the inside than the outside. Oh, did you not notice? I just thought it was supposed to be bigger on the inside, so I didn't say anything. Well, of course it's supposed to be bigger. Most people are confused by that. I find everything confusing, Mom. So I don't say anything. That's how come I'm in the woods. I thought Miss Oswald told me to find the doctor, but it wasn't her. It was just in my head. Miss Oswald, dark hair, highly unpredictable, surprisingly round face. Everyone says she's in love with Mr. Pink. The PE teacher. Max, I really like him. I was in his group. Mr. Pink was looking at you. Well, that explains why you're lost. It doesn't surprise you that I know all about your school. Everyone seems to know everything about everything apart from me. That's not quite true. I, for instance, have no idea why when the terrestrial navigation... The terrestrial navigation starts up and closes down all the other systems. You should ask somebody who knows. That's another of the drawbacks of being the last of your species. No one to ask when your TARDIS won't start. You have reached your destination. No, we haven't. We're supposed to be in the middle of London. You have reached your destination. Oh, stop saying that. She's only saying it because it's true. We are in the middle of London. We are in the middle of a forest. Come and see. Nelson's column. Do you like it? Do I? Sorry, what? Do you like the forest being in Trafalgar Square? I think it's lovely.
Look at it. Does it scare you? Yes. Well, that's good. You want to know why that's good? Why? Let me tell you about scared. Your heart is beating so hard. I can feel it through your hands. There's so much blood and oxygen pumping through your brain. It's like rocket fuel. Right now, you could run faster and you could fight harder. You could jump higher than ever in your life. And you are so alert. It's like you can slow down time. What's wrong with scared? Scared is a superpower. It's your superpower. There is danger in this room. And guess what? It's you. Do you feel it? Do you think he feels it? Do you think he's scared? Yeah. Loser. Turn your back on it. What? Yeah. Turn your back on it. Come on. You too, Clara. Clara, your back now. Do it. Just do it now. Turn your back. Do it now. Turn your back. Lovely view out this window. Yeah. Come and see all the dark. The deep and lovely dark. We'd never see the stars without it. Now, there are two possibilities. Possibility one, it's just one of your friends standing there. He's playing a joke on you. Possibility two, it isn't. So, plan? Plans are good. You're on the bed. I'm talking to you now. Go in peace. We won't look. Just go. If all you want to do is stay hidden, it's OK. Just leave. Is it gone? Don't look round. Not yet. I can't hear anything. Don't. Look away, look away now. Don't look at it. Don't look round, don't look round, don't look at the reflection. What is it? Imagine a thing that must never be seen. What would it do if you saw it? I don't know. Neither do I. Close your eyes. What? Close your eyes. You too, Clara. Give it what it wants. Prove to it that you're not going to look at it. Make a promise. A promise you're never going to look at it. I promise never to look. Breath on the back of your neck. Like your hair's standing on end. That means. Be a, a little bit much, but. Woo! What do you reckon, Doctor? By all the saints. Are there any more in there? Is that. No. Oh my god. Oh my god, it is, isn't it? Oh, you found him. You actually found Robin Hood. That is not Robin Hood. Well, then, who, sir, is about to relieve you of your magic box? Nobody, sir. Not in this universe or the next. Well, then draw your sword and prove your words. I have no sword. I don't need a sword. Because I am the Doctor. And this is my spoon. Honga! Ow! You're amazing. Had some experience. Richard the Lionheart. Sonalo de Bajrak. Errol Flynn. He had the most enormous <clears throat> ego. Takes one to no one. Oh! Like I said, my box. Doctor? I'm 
Do we start the clock? Not yet. Focus. 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 All of that is your grief, your trauma, your resentment. And now, it's mine. It's gone. No, no, it's not enough for me. Because now it thinks I'm you. Start the clock. Hello. I'm so pleased to finally see you. I'm the doctor and I will be your victim this evening. Are you my mummy? Yeah. You can't hurt me until my time is up, I think. So are there magic words? Is there a way to stop you in your tracks? Oh, you really didn't like your grand, did you? Something visible under the bandages. By the way, you weren't being paranoid. She really did poison your pony. <gasps> Markings like the ones on the scroll. Oh, it's your father. <laughs> Sorry. A tattered piece of cloth attached to length of wood that you will kill for. 30 that seconds. That doesn't sound like a scroll. That sounds like a flag. And if that sounds like a flag, if this is a flag, that means that you are a soldier. Wounded in a forgotten war thousands of years ago. But they've worked on you, haven't they, son? State-of-the-art phase camouflage, personal teleporter. Ten seconds. And all that tape inside you, it just won't let you die. Well, it won't let the war end. It just won't let you stop until the war is over. We surrender! Zero. I can see it again. It's OK. I think we all can. Do I start the clock? No. The clock has stopped. You're a relieved soldier. He's not the only one. We were fighting that. So was he. Listen, what is... David, we're not out of the woods yet. Well, Gus, I think we solved your little puzzle. Ancient soldier being driven by malfunctioning tech. Thank you so much for your efforts. They are greatly appreciated. Unfortunately, survivors of this exercise are not required. Oh, well, there's a shocker. Air will now be removed from the entire train. We hope you've enjoyed your journey on the Orient Express. I take you no way out. My enemy's enemy is my friend, especially when he has a built-in teleporter. Wait, so use it. A little more work. Doctor. A couple of minutes, Max. I'll give you a shout. I... I... remember. You saw the truth, Rusty. Remember how you felt. You saw a star being born. The endless rebirth of the universe. No! And you realized the truth about the Daleks. Truth? What is the truth? Let me show you the truth. I've opened your mind. And now I'm coming in. Door's never gonna hold, but I'm damned I'm gonna make it easy for them. I'm part of you. My mind is in your mind. I see your mind, Doctor. I see your universe. And isn't the universe beautiful? I see beauty. Yes, that's good. That is good. Hold on to that. I see endless divine perfection. Make it a part of you. Remember how you feel right now. Put it inside you and live by it. I see into your soul, Doctor. I see beauty. I see divinity. I see hatred. Hatred. I see your hatred of the Daleks, and it is good. No, 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 no. no you must see more than that. There must be more than that. Death to the Daleks. Death to the Daleks. Death to the Daleks! Oh, there must be more than that. There must be more than that, please! Daleks are evil! Daleks must be exterminated! Daleks are evil! God save us all! Daleks must be exterminated! <laughs>
what you do, isn't it?